there's good human connections and bonds. Like there's a really strong friendship and like that whole coming of age and trying to decide whether you're gonna go with the crowd or if you're gonna stay like true to your real friends. And then there's this relationship that develops between Denise and Ben that's more of like a brother sister. And it, it's, it's kind of weird how it works out, but it's got a lot of heart in the movie too. When you have three boys that are the leads, you don't expect the female character to be anything more than just like, you know, eye candy. A nice little dis distraction may have a good line or two, but in most movies that's, that is what it is. When you have three strong lead males, the girl just kind of falls flat. And I think Denise is an equally strong character and who's just as important to the story as the boys. Chris has done a really great job balancing the horror with the comedy because, I mean, it, the comedy in it is very dry. It's very dry and smart and sarcastic humor. It's not slapstick. This is a much more physical role than I thought it was going to be. Like, I had no idea how physical it was going to be. And the boys were cast a lot earlier than I was, and I was kind of cast last minute, so they did, you know, like, three weeks, two hours a day of stunt training, and I did one week, five hours a day, and so when we got into it, I was already just, like, sore from places I didn't even know about, and then I, once I got on set, it was much more physical than I thought it would be. There's a lot of action. A lot. Did you know that Pumba in The Lion King was the first character to fart in a Disney movie? For this and more movie facts, click on more videos.